What's up everybody? I don't even know what day it is. End of 36, 37? Something like that, out of 40 days of drumming. Um, another kind of tired day today. Um, I guess I've just been doing this for a long time and I'm physically wiped out. Um, wasn't quite able to connect like I was yesterday, but I think that's um, kind of normal, or at least that's what he explains in the book, is that, you know, you'll kind of find the space and you'll get into it and then the next time or next day you know you'll either be trying too much or trying to do what you did last time and then it's you know it's this oscillating process of find the space lose the space um I did you know I was having another kind of funky hip day with my right hip, but finally towards the end of the night kind of really paid close attention to what that hip was doing uh, from when I would sit at rest, where I could tell that I was on both sit bones versus once I started playing a beat and I would as soon as I started having to use that leg I would kind of take the weight off of that hip. I kind of thought it was the opposite. I thought I was putting a lot of weight on that hip. But it, I guess it turns out that I was releasing the weight from that hip, putting the weight on my left hip. And that's why I would crunch over to the left side. Um, so it's really weird, man. It feels off balance it feels off center when I put the weight on both hip bones evenly but it, I look in the mirror and that's when my torso is straight you know and even like though I've been trying to really get it straight usually once I start playing I'll, I'll close my eyes and then I look and I'm, I'm leaning to the left a little bit so think hopefully that's kind of the root of the issue it became a lot easier to play the bass drum when I was able to remember that you know I wasn't able to remember it all the time but um, when I would stay focused on it like the bass drum foot the whole thing felt a lot more solid um, it's funny, it's like little teeny tweaks now, you know, but at, at least I'm getting to the root of the, the issue. So hopefully that's what it is. Hopefully I'll be able to maintain that. And if I, if I kind of stay focused on what that hip bone, that sit bone does while I play, hopefully that will kind of fix the issue obviously the other stuff that I was dealing with with tension and all of that but it's like the tension kept coming back and I couldn't figure out why so hopefully this is it <laughs> um, yeah that's it I'm tired <laughs> good night